What's going on, guys? And welcome back to Assassin's Creed Mirage. We are now continuing uh, after last episode's events of us assassinating Al Ahul. Al Hul. The, the G is kind of silent. Um, but we infiltrated this thing. We got the focus bar thing as well. We have got quite a bit of variety. But hopefully, you're having a good morning, afternoon, or evening. We are still live streaming over on the Twitch, doing the marathon. Um, so throughout, throughout this video, you might see me once or twice or a couple of times speak to the chat um, or respond to somebody from chat. Um, but we are going to continue today and push on. We do have a new investigation, I believe, which is that's the guy, the slave. I'm locked out right now. There's an animation. Okay. My old home. Could Nihal be back uh, at our hideout? So we did see Nihal. Uh, after we killed this guy inside the compound uh, and he wants to go over there. So, with um, permission from Rahal, our master, all is good. 1,280 meters away. Where am I going for that? Oh, I think we might need to get on our camel because that is the old town, isn't it? That's where we... Oh, so we have the city down here. Wait, over here. And then this is all. Ooh. Okay, so we got a little bit of traveling to do. We have got a viewpoint at the water mill and a historical site. So we might as well go and get them. Because I don't want to miss any of these stuff whilst I'm about and here. We've got a couple of historical sites here as well. I might as well just collect them. And then we're going to move on. But first up, I want to grab this banner, this poster that's down here to reduce our notoriety, which is 38 meters this way. Oh, he's... you don't want me to use a token, are you? Is it going to get rid of all of it, though? Or just a section? The shorts are hard on my heels. Ooh, you got rid of all of it. Citizens of Baghdad. Our scholars advise us that the signs point towards flooding on the banks of the Tijla this season. Okay. Please secure your homes and procure plaster in So at least I won't get spotted now by people who like to snitch on me and all that kind of good stuff. Right, that's one of them. And there's another one around this corner, isn't there? Over here. So I want to grab that. I swear one of them just farted. Should be right here. And now, time to head to the tower. You look like a sad-ass cow. Yeah, I'm talking to you. You're stroking yourself on me for it. Okay, I'm going. All right, so the Eagle Tower is just here. The Observation Tower. Can I climb? There we go. Loads of bird doo-doo. Points of interest discovered. Historical sites 13, Mysterious Shard 2. Oh, well, there's a historical site right there. And what else was around here? Not really much. And then from here, we need to head far north. A couple of these viewpoints here as well. I'll probably pass this one, grab that whilst I'm going through. So let's go and get this historical point just down here. Where is it? It's just literally there. Who's this guy? Oh, it's the uh, it's the guy we saved. Ali, I trust you and Master Roshan were able to find common ground. That woman is as stubborn as they come. But yes, we are allies, mine and yours. I hear there is one less blight on these lands. Al Ghul may they just end, and so too will the rest. Spoken with unfeigned sincerity, passion. You would make a great rebel. 
and you an awful hidden one. Ha! Huh. Where will you take your fight? If there is anywhere in Baghdad that could use our attention, it would be Sharqiya. A place teeming with vermin. Now we have the means to do something about it. I expect our paths to cross again, ya Sadiqi. As do I, Basim. As do I. Alright. I don't have much info. I thought it might give us, like, other missions. Maybe, like, side quests and stuff, but maybe not. Codex updated. Big house wheel. Now we just need to head north, don't we? Oh, there's a chest here. Ooh. I like how this thing moves with an anvil in front of it, but I couldn't push it back early when there's a bloody pot behind it. A new day. I, uh, I give praise to God, though his will, Ali, uh, Ali, has returned to us. It is a sign, the mark of a new beginning, and the God is behind us. Word will spread of our resurgence. Our band will swell, and, and as, as it does... We will consume the rot there so deeply woven into the fabric of this city. A free world awaits. Find a key. Who's got the key? A Kindu's not available as well. Who's got a key? Survey the area in Kidu. Climb down! Get in the water, you spoon! Jeez. Well, I found the key for this. Hidden one dagger. Treasure collected. Hidden one dagger. Ooh. Melee kills of poisoned enemies create a poison cloud that damages nearby enemies. So if I was to throw a dagger at someone with the poison ability, then kill somebody, that guy will fart, basically and uh, spread his stench to the others is basically what that dagger will do. It will literally be a bag of gas. All right. So I guess I don't oh. think there is anything else we can do in this village. We've got what we needed to. I guess we just head northbound. Arabian Nights Arabian Dude 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 Is that an ostrich? It's an ostrich! Now these birds can't fly. Speed! Dum, 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 dum. <laughs> What is this, though? I'm guessing that's the rock we're going to climb up to. And I need to sneeze. <coughs> <sighs> Thank you. I want to climb this thing. What is this camp, though? It's like a little mining camp. Dirt. I can't even pronounce that. There we go. All right. What the? Can I not climb this? These. Oh. What the hell? I was gonna say if we couldn't climb this, that'd be weird. You can kind of see where we can climb because it's like the only rocks we can climb on are the white ones. 
you just got to ignore all the black ones. Even though we could just technically just jump up there. <laughs> what a weird ass rock. It's got layers. It's like a bloody cake. Wilderness. Well, there's where we're heading to over there. You see what I mean? Like the, it, it feels like the uh, the map is a little bit different scale to the actual world. It feels like this is a lot further away than it is. But we have one thousand eight and uh, well eight hundred and ninety three meters to go. We can even see the village from here. Where did that is going to? <laughs> that was a deep dark hole. We can see the focus bar now at the bottom. A little treasure cave. I still don't have any grenades. Because clearly I can't blow that wall up. But saying that. What's in here? Well, I wonder if we can take that over there. Come on, be nice to me. Be nice to me. Eh, 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 eh. Got it. Peacock feather. I 
I didn't expect that to fall down there, I'm not going to lie to you. got a tool upgrade as well. Hidden one dagger upgrade schematic. We've literally just found the, up, the, the knife for that. And we've already found the schematic for it. That's all right, isn't it? Give me them Durham's. Typical game though, right? You have all these like treasure and all these coins you can see laying underneath it, but you can only connect and collect so many of it. <laughs> Typical. Bloody typical. Can we get out that door? Oh, I guess we're going to go out the way we came in. Unless there's something behind that waterfall. Spicy. The way out. Beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful. Now we can unbar the door and get out of here. That was a nice little thing. Maybe I maybe I should look into that um, using that knife. Could upgrade it, but I can't upgrade mine now. Forget. I do like the slow motion of it though. It gives me time to quickly look around and react. Whereas this one kind of gives me a poison cloud. Melee kills of poisoned enemies. That means I've got to use a dagger to poison someone, then kill that person with a melee, which then will create the poison cloud. Perfect parry, slow down time for three seconds. Hmm. So there's the schematic for that knife we just picked up. Maybe we need to head to a blacksmith and do that. Plus, we need to head to a... Uh, uh, back to the uh, assassin little guild thing. The bureau. So we can uh, upgrade our tool. Alright, so we've just arrived into Anbar. Which is where we first started. I'm going to guess... The bodies that was hanging pretty early game are not going to be there anymore. Unless they are, as a statement. Well, it should just be around the corner here. 160 meters away. I'm getting chased by a chicken. Rooster. Yeah, because this is, we was going through all of these. these the slums right at the beginning. When we didn't have our Assassin's Creed uh, stuff. The Hidden Ones outfits. Let's see if she's still here. Really, you? Yes. Yeah. Mm. I. Uh. Say nothing, yes, Sadiq. I am as sorry as you. I have so much to tell you. And I, you. We will grant each other an audience. But first, I must know something. What? 
Why are you dressed like a peasant? <clears throat> Perhaps I have less to tell you than I thought. I think I can surmise what our time apart has been like for you. And you? You have not been living here, I hope. <laughs> less living, more working. On what? Why do I know this? Because you have seen it. On the object we found at the Winter Palace. I have been trying to remember the specifics of its design. You have spent all this time obsessing over this symbol? Why? Because I too have seen it before. I know not where or when. Only that I have. Whatever it is, it calls to me. I intend to unravel its mystery, and so should you. Ah, but of course. Duty calls. Stop. I will bear it in mind if it means you will spend more time outside these musty walls than you do within. You really do spare a thought for everyone, don't you, Basim? Araki Lahika. Hmm. Well. The Order of the Ancients are far from defeated. Master Roshan is certain to have a plan brewing to uproot them. And perhaps I should look into Nihal's obsession. It's... Well, Nihal's obsession. So we need to investigate this a bit more. Has been obsessed with the ancient writings. Find the hidden place. Nihal's note mentions an oasis north of a quiff. A quiff dunes, an oasis. Let's track that. Nihal is trying to discover the location of a secret chamber. A quiff. <laughs> God damn it, evil. Um, so this, uh, where was the? Uh, was this the the quiff down? <laughs> no, it's not. <laughs> I can't. I can't say that now with a straight face. So we've got a few things that we need to collect in this town. What is that? Mysterious shard. That's the first time we come across one of these, right? What's going on here? Does this guy need assassinating? We need to kill him. Is that what we need to do right now? A small, strange shard. Yet it weighs heavily in my hand. What put is it. it, I wonder? Don't put it in your pocket. Your pants might fall down. I could have used that bloody bomb right there. Well, there was a witness. A bloody witness. Bag. Mysterious shard. Change strange energy. Hmm. I found a strange shard on a member of the order. Oh, that was part of the mission. Ooh. All right, let's climb this bad boy. Can I go? Uh, come on. There we go. And jump. Oh, the chest in this one. Leather and stuff. Yeah. All right. Can we see any more of the objectives over here? I think the other thing we need to do is just kind of follow that little riddle of trying to find the oasis. And then use our, uh, the, the bird. The bird. Here we go. So we got a couple of things now. 
So we could go and grab that, but then... What's this? What was the, uh, the place called? North of... A cork of dunes. Isn't that like way, way, way down here? Is this the oasis? This is the oasis, isn't it? Because this is the dunes. That's the oasis. So we need to head all the way over here, which is... It looks far, but it doesn't... It won't be. This must be the oasis Nihal oh. had in mind. Here we go. The northern oasis. Oh, look, flamingos. Did you guys know flamingos can fly? <laughs> Did you know they can fly? I found out less than 24 hours ago. So this is the dunes, right? So there's something here that we need to do. But let's get up this little tower, scan it, and look around. But apparently we've got to find the hidden place. It is located north of the Aquarkov Dunes. Let us get a wider view. Let's get a wider view. What am I looking for? Because on the map we don't see anything, right? What is that? Secret entrance. We gotta go swimming. Time for a swim. Hey, you. Oh, what is this? The note? Yeah. Al Hul's letter. We need more workers at the southern site. Stop it your excavations and bring them to the me as fast as you can until you find a way to reach the chamber under the oasis. I should the shards should not be left. The shards should not be left unguarded. The Thahabin will carry them all the time. So we'll... nothing can hide from us, Enkidu. All right, there. Like I said, we are still going for a swim, just under the water. All right. Just keep swimming. Just keep swimming. 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 Just keep swimming. Just keep swimming. This leads. I don't know, I'm thinking the same thing. Please tell me it's a secret cave where we can get like a, a rare outfit. Magic is this. Oh. Surely there is a way to diminish it. A sword? Maybe that's armor? A dagger? Place two mysterious shards. Place five. Place three. <gasps> Ooh. Nice. Now we just need to find these shards. 
They could be anywhere. Scratch that. We can see them. So there was one up here. Most of them are going to be in the city. So it was three for the sword, two for the dagger, five for the armor, I'm guessing. What do we go for first? I think the armor. Right, so now that we've got this, I found a strange shard on a member of the order. Reveal the chamber's secrets. So we just need to go and get a shard now. We can either go and get the two, we can only get a second one now and go and get the dagger, or we can go and get, maybe I'll just go over here and just pick up one shard. But there's two right, wasn't there two at the side of each other? I'm pretty sure there was, right? Because I can fast travel, right? I can fast travel to the bureau. Yeah, here we go. Fast travel here, grab a couple of shards, but it can't just be easy as just picking them up, right? <laughs> Hello, it's me. That person looks suspicious. I should investigate. Ah, here we go. Hey, taste this! That's it! Another We got a shard. Now let's go and grab more. I want to collect them all. You can now call me a Pokemon trainer. Wait, where's the, where was the next one from here? It was this one, wasn't it? And there's one over here as well. I, I won't be able to collect them all right now because there's going to be something that's going to be in, in uh, undis uh, undiscovered locations, right? All right, so there's another one just here. A Thabine member is near. Act as usual. Hey, that's close hey. enough. What's hey. oh, I'm good now. Did you stop yet? Mm. Where can I hide? Oh. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> 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 Brings me one step closer to uncovering the missing chamber. Come on, I block you. It's one of these guys. Anybody else? There's another one right there. Is there any more closer to me? Come on, there must be one more I can see. If not, there isn't, is there? There isn't. Good one! Too slow! 
Jesus. We need one more shard. Which is down. Oh, there's one there. Sounds to the wrong person. These guys. Nice. So killing them guys, it's like they're captains and you lose your notoriety when you uh, kill them guys. Which is not so bad. It's like if you kill an elite guard, you kind of lose your notoriety, which is pretty decent. That music was nice though. Bump it but the bump it but the bump it the bump it the bump it but the bump. This place is totally a different looking district compared to the other ones. This looks very more like that markets child looks and like he has gotten himself into a tricky situation. The boy is quite a climber. If you come closer, I will jump. Wait, what? Whoa! Mm. My name is Basim. And I climbed up here without thinking it through. Do you think you could help me get down? <laughs> <laughs> when I was your age, I did all kinds of foolish things to impress my friends. I did not do it for them. I did it for the hidden ones. Ah, the hidden ones. Not everyone believes in them, but I do. They're the true protectors of the people. 
They were the ones who avenged my mother. Not the Khalifa or his men. <laughs> the Hidden Ones did that. I see. And you thought this would get their attention, climbing up here. I heard they can die from great heights and not get hurt. But I cannot do something unless I see someone else do it first. Do you think you could do it if I showed you? <laughs> he doesn't realize he's stood next to a hidden one. Yes, you can. Do not overthink it. Please hit you the ground. You simply need to have faith. How funny would it be if he hit the ground? <laughs> I am fine. Give me a second. It would have been Are so funny if he missed, like a, like <laughs> just a little bit to no. the right or something. Nothing broken. Oh my God, kids, can you? You are a fast learner. I told you, I can do anything if only someone shows me first. <laughs> that is a valuable talent. Be sure to have a good teacher next time you try something risky like that. You could teach me. <laughs> I am no teacher. I still have much to learn. No, you are a good teacher. You teach by example. Are, are you... Seek me out when your voice begins to break. <laughs> then we will talk. Grow some balls, basically. That was amazing! Come on, Hytham! Before the Muezzin catches us! I am coming! Hey, we got a skill point. We've only got the one, though, so we can't purchase anything because we need two minimum. Do what, brother? What about? Dope. Uh, investigation. Obviously, we can now go back and grab that, but I do want one more uh, shard, which is what we're going to grab. We've got four. So I'd rather go for the five, right? There's a reason it's five, but I also want to see a, a blacksmith as well. Hey, ladies. Hey, did you have any of This shard brings me one step closer to uncovering the mystery. That was the, the easiest one yet. And it was the, 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 the challenge of that one was trying to get to it. It took me about bloody 15 minutes to travel this far. Oh. Alhamdulillah. 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 I am glad you are safe. Alhamdulillah. A first of many achievements to come, Basim. We should only hope. There's still much work to do. While our focus was on Al Ghul, Fula quietly scouted the city for where we could erect more bureaus. I have found dwellings in three districts that are most unassuming. Ibid and Rebecca have arrived from Alamut and set off to Al Abbasia and Karh. I will make my way to Sharqia shortly. And I will join Rebecca in Karh, where corruption is as common as the arid air. See Abu Jafar about some things he's been working on. Then come find us. Have a look, Basim. I may have something that is of interest to you. Oh, new tools. Noisemakers. Traps. A non-lethal proximity explosive. Capable of knocking down enemies for long periods. Can be made deadly. Smoke bombs which we've kind of used one of them. We've hit a few pots for them. And a blow dart. A silent projectile capable of putting targets to sleep. Can be modified to apply poison or cause a fit of rage. Ooh. Can be turned into a weapon. I think with this trap one, you need to know the route. I feel like I want to go with a smoke bomb. Unlock smoke bomb. Yes. This should serve me well. My thanks, Ahmed. It's Abu Jaf... <laughs> oh, you jest. Every now and again. Araka lahikan, Abu Jafar. Keep well. And you, Basim. One thing I liked, though, it kind of... Um... Nice to see you. Unlock tool. Wait. What new wonders have you created? Take a look. 
Our tools to unlock zero. Okay. I like how it gives us the option to choose what we want and didn't force us to like use a noisemaker. Seen enough? You know? If you can improve this in any way, be my guest. All right, we can upgrade this. What can the smoke bomb do actually for upgrades? Increase the uh, ammunition capacity, increase the distance you can throw this tool, increase how long the smoke remains, uh, silent blast. Enemies can no longer hear smoke bombs detonate. Healing Vapor recovers some of Basim's health if he's inside the smoke. Choking fumes damage enemies caught inside the smoke. Causes guards, uh, causes guards caught in the smoke to forget they saw Basim. And flammable smoke. Smoke ignites if it is contact with flames, setting everything within it on fire. So I feel... Maybe extra... Extra capacity, or maybe throw distance, silent blast, and mind wipe. I feel like that's the way I'm kind of going. But I want to finish off the blade. We're going to unlock this. And we could go with corrode body or armor piercing against the heavy units, so we can... Penetrate armor, or we can go with corrode. I'm leaning right now to more stealth over fighting. If I can take out a guard before he even spots me, I don't need these. But if I can go to corrode a body, I feel like that might be useful. So let's activate that. And we can't do the smoke one right now because we need 60 cogs and we only have 12. Nothing else? No. Next up, your help is invaluable. We need to head Farewell. to a blacksmith. All what right, let's upgrade my dagger. Um, I can give it a good lick for you. Oh no, we can't. We can't upgrade the dagger because we've just upgraded. Ah, <sighs> maybe we can't then. Is that all for now? Uh, yes. I have to go. So long. I guess to the oasis it is, which is quite far away, and I don't believe I can fast travel to that location, unless I can fast... You can fast travel to the waypoint. And we want to see what is inside this cave. Alright, here we go. Time to see what is in here. Excellent. The shards work. Perhaps I can use some more. Milad's outfit. Whoa. Successful Ur assassination set off a flash of lightning to disorient bystanders within a 15 meter I am turning into bloody Thor look at that and it's already upgraded as well Ooh. so now we need to find three more shards to unlock the sword and two more for the dagger Well, this outfit looks insane. We need to find a guard I can thunderclap on. I want multiple. I feel like going to a gate entrance might be ideal. Time to thunderclap. It didn't do the lightning. It didn't do the lightning. Scammed. It 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 didn't thunderclap. It it didn't thunderclap. Successful Ur assassination set off a flash of lightning to disorientate bystanders with a 15 meter. Ah, no, it it did work. It did work. That's why he was stood there holding his eyeballs. 
So. Bam. Flash. And now he's stunned. Little bit shit, though. Do you want to know who I sound and look like? The guy from uh, Starfield. The Hunters. 